All right, so I was actually about to just like save and turn off my console, but I got this. Uh, I'm afraid that today is your last day on this team. So I think this is two things. When I first got called in, I was like, oh, I'm going to get yelled at for stealing bases. Uh, but I think either we got called out, which it seems kind of early for, or we got traded. Either one I would be happy about, <laughs> but I don't know. So... I'm just going to say, uh, tell me what I want to hear. Uh, let's see what it is. Called up? Hey, wow, that was pretty early. It's only May. So, I feel like it usually happens in, like, June, July, like, around the All-Star game for AA, but I'll just say, oh, wow. I don't think it really matters which one I say, but all right, um, great, that's fantastic we've earned this opportunity he kind of gives me like pete davidson vibes this manager does doesn't he i know i'm not the only one that sees it but all right i guess we're playing our triple a debut this episode so <laughs> guess we're gonna have to continue i'm actually recording this right after i recorded the other but uh there we are just chilling on our tv or chilling in our hotel room watching tv that is one thing, like, if I was a professional athlete, like, I don't, I won't have to worry about it, but I don't, I don't know how well I could do, like, just hotel to hotel. I guess if you're, like, with friends and buddies, it's, it's a lot easier, like, aside from just being by yourself. Uh, I'm ready to take the next step. Yep. Thank you, Stephanie. Wish it was with a different team. Uh, I mean, I didn't really have time to make friends with my teammates, so, which is probably for the best. But with the Rockies, I'm sure I'll see them in no time. Won't take much to replace them. <laughs> All right, we're going to the what are, what are the Albuquerque Isotopes. Yeah, that's what I thought they were. Good stuff. Congrats on your promote. Look at that shirt. I'm going to have to try and find that shirt. I think I'm going to have to buy that. I don't know where I can get something like that. It, it's very, like... Gives me, like, South vibes, like Texas. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like you need a cow... Just the design up top. Just one step away from the Rockies. Shouldn't take much, right? That's probably why we got called up already. There's not much competition. I'm ready to get to the majors. I'm not gonna lie, Kid AAA is pretty inti... Uh, let, let's see the roster first, and I'll tell you how intimidating it is. Let me see who we got. Who, who are we working with? Oh, nice. Double... Uh, XP games. I love the cat. We got my cat in the background. See him? Stew babies. I'm, I won't bother him. I feel bad bothering him when he's sleeping. All right. Let's go ahead and shoot for, I don't know, 500 likes. Smash that like button. Show that love and support. I'm sorry for bumping my mic. Subscribe. Join the Dorsal Fam. I want to see what we're working with here. Uh, let's see. Zach Veen. Okay. That's a good prospect. Sterling Thompson. I think I've heard the name. Benny Montgomery, he's a C, though. He's already a 65 overall, though. Fielding? Fielding and speed, that's why. Hunter Goodman. This guy's a 67, though. All right, so solid. Uh, Not worried about that guy. Now the fun part, the pitching. Do they have any pitching prospects? I think I know these two names, but I think they're a little... Yeah, 29 and 30. I was going to say, I don't think they're young. Oh, this guy's good. Chase... Dolander, Dolander, Dolander. I don't know who he is, but he's, I guess he's pretty good. I've heard of Feltner. Uh, Prosecchi, I don't think I know that name. I've heard of him, I think. And John Curtis, but again, these are like vets that have probably been bouncing back and forth. But all right. Good stuff. Uh, let's go ahead and... Uh, oh my gosh, wow. Didn't he have like a really dominant start What one year? I don't know what year it was, but there was one year he was like doing really well. Like he started out hot. I think it was one of these two years. And then he just kind of like fell off. All right, I don't know whatever happened to him. I know Kyle, Kyle Freeland. All right, we're getting off topic here, off task. We need to focus. It's our major or major minor league debut. Uh, did I? Oh, it's probably just I'm not worried about it. Packs to open. I'm good. I like quick sold all of my uh, like gold cards that I pulled because I don't play Diamond Dynasty. So I think I'm going to buy like equipment though once we probably get called up. I don't know what I'll get, but. 
we'll have to wait and see. Like, I don't want to spend the 30,000 subs I have or close to it on, like, catcher's gear. <laughs> so I'll probably get it, like, cleats or probably not the glove. There's just, like, a certain, like, it seems different. I didn't know if I was, like, pinch hitting. There was, like, no, like, pregame thing. Unless, I don't know if there has been in the previous one. This is Jack Leiter, isn't it? It's a name I haven't heard in a bit. I don't know. I guess, like, because Skeens has taken all the... Yeah, Le Leiter was, like, pretty hyped. I don't know if he just hasn't been doing well, but... I can't remember. Do the AAA and AA stadiums differ or No. I can't remember, like, if you can play at the same stadium at both levels. I would think so, but I don't know if they try to separate them. I wish they kind of replicated them or did, like, somewhat of a decent job replicating them. But, like, at least for just the triple A and double A teams, because there's not as much work that needs to go into them. It's like they have no problem creating all these template stadiums, so... Why not create some minor league stadiums, like actual minor league stadiums? Like I know someone made. Uh, so I'm, in, I live in North Carolina now. Used to live in Jersey. That's why I'm a big Philly fan, as you can probably tell behind me. But um, so I've gone to the Durham Bulls games. I think like three times already, uh, since 2022, and uh, someone made their stadium, and I thought it was cool. Like they have a really nice minor league stadium. I've only been to the Trenton Thunder, and I mean, I've been to, like, the Camden River Sharks back when they were a team, but they, they weren't affiliated with Major League Baseball. They were, like, an independent league. So, yeah, I think I've only been to the Trenton Thunder and Durham in terms of minor league parks. And, um, I mean, Durham was by far the nicest. It's really nice. They have, like, a tall wall out in left field. Not as tall as the Monster, but it's tall. Like, it's high up. And it's out of everywhere. Like, I'd rather stand there than sit in any of the seats. It's just a really cool view up there. Because it's pretty short. And then there's, like, you can st you can stand there. Like, you just need a regular ticket. It's not like a certain... It's not like the Green Monster where you have to have monster seats. And, um... Yeah, I don't even think I said mentioned anything about getting our first AAA hit. I wonder how long it'll take for us to get called up. I mean, this was probably one of the quickest AAA call-ups. I, I shouldn't have swung at that, but that might actually bloop in. Wow. That was kind of a bad effort by the second baseman. That was not a good hit, but I'll take it. Good stuff. I was like, I definitely don't think the center fielder is catching that, but I wasn't sure about the, the second baseman. But yeah, like someone made the Durham Bowl Stadium. I think like the first year created stadiums were a thing. Which was what two years ago, and uh, it was it was cool. Like it looked good. It's it's just like I feel like the create or the like everyday people like you and me. Wow, we're three for three. Sometimes put in more effort than like the people that actually make the game. But I don't know. That's just me. Like some of the effort that goes into making these stadiums that one person puts in is like insane. It's And it's like they use these props that it's like you don't even think about using for like, like you can't make domes or anything like that. But like I'll see people make like, in, like retractable roofs. Like I've saw one cause I was trying to get inspiration for my Vegas one. Um, and like they use the arches kind of like what St. Louis has like the arch. And they just used a bunch of those to make it look like one of those roofs that kind of like close like that. And I was like, wow, that's awesome. But you can't really put them directly over the field, which sucks. But I wish they had some kind of like height. I should have stole. Yeah, I definitely should have stole now. Um, but what was I going to say? Yeah, I don't understand why they're like, it's so restricted on like what where you can put things in this game. Like, for, wow, four for four now. Like, where you can put, um, like, props and stuff. Like, you can't have it so close to the field, even though it's not even close to the field. Like, depending on where your fence is. 
things can't be cl close to the batter's eye. And I just don't think it should matter if it's your stadium. But I guess they don't want people like like grinding XP cheap cheaply. I don't, I don't know. Like if I want to train on my field, let me put a train on the field. If I want a cow on my field, let me put a cow on the field. That's what I'm saying. But, oh well, it is what it is. What can you do? But I wish you could have, like, a roof. Like, I, I don't understand why that's still not a thing. I just think that would be pretty neat. Just going to first. See, that's that's a good... That's good baseball right there. Second and third. 3-0 count. He'll probably just get walked. Set up the play at any bag. I don't know why he didn't just intentionally walk him, but... All right. Pitcher worked even harder than he needed to, but this does set up the play at any bag. I'm not going to steal because there is the chance of him striking out. Oh, no. They're not going to get anything. We tied it up. I didn't realize that we were... It, like I was thinking that could be the winning run, but we won anyway. All right, we'll probably play one or two more and then call it. I didn't realize how long we've already been going for because I was rambling looking at the roster in the beginning of the episode. But let's go ahead and play the next one. But yeah, at this pace, we might get to the majors in the next episode. We've only had two double-A episodes, right? I'm fine with that, though. That works for me. I won't complain about it. Batting a thousand. I kind of don't want to hit anymore. Oh, man. Win and Finn. Uh, I think he's got it. Yeah. I didn't think that was going to get down. I hear the thunder, though. Oh, he's laying one down. We got him. Didn't go far down the line. Far enough down the line. But I know people usually create like minor league stadiums, spring training stadiums. Well, I think the spring training stadiums are minor league stadiums. Like, it, like usually it's like the single A team. You guys remember when there was like eight levels in baseball? I think there's only there's only four now, right? Or is the is the uh, Gulf Coast League the GCL, and then there's like the FCL and like ACL or well one's the fall league like the AFL but there used to be like a another CL like FCL I don't know but um yeah I think now there's two single A's there used to be three Ooh. and and, uh, and then there's double A AA and triple A there were a lot of levels though like I do think it was kind of excessive how many levels there were like there didn't need to be that many Baseball is like the only sport that has so many different levels of minor league. Like, just so many different minor league levels. I don't know why I swung at that. Football doesn't even have one, although it should. I really want minor league football. Uh, basketball has the G League. And then hockey has the AHL. I don't know if anyone like cares about the G League, though. And I want to say it's like somewhat newer. But I don't know who really plays in them because there's only like two draft picks, right? In basketball. So. I don't know if like the draft pick will sometimes play in the G League or they'll bounce back and forth. I don't know how moves work for that league, but I really want football to have a like because they just have the practice squad. Like I want to see the third string quarterback get reps. Give you a better idea of maybe there sh if they should be the backup. Oh, nice. That was a good at bat. We didn't swing at the best pitches, but we got the walk. I'll take it. Did I get a hit in the last game? I don't even know. Safe. Safe all around. Man, if you can't even get me out at second, that's a problem. <laughs> With my 46 speed. And that's only because of what's it called? Should I go home? No, I'm not going to go home. No, thank you. Another thing with creating stadiums, this, this made me think about it looking at the bullpen. The bullpen's on the field. I don't think there's a single major league stadium anymore that still has bullpens on the field. 
I know, uh... That's fallen. I'll bring in two. I know Wrigley... They moved to, like, under the bleachers now in the outfield. Uh, there was... Uh, San Francisco had, like, one... Or no, both teams were on the field. I can't remember where they are now, though. The bullpens. I don't think they're still on the field. I think they're in... Are they, like... I think they're, like, where McCovey Cove is. Like, under there. Under that brick wall. I think. But, yeah, it used to be on the field. Which is odd, because that's, like, a somewhat newer stadium. But, uh... But, all right. I think we're going to wrap it up there, guys. Um, I hope you all enjoyed. Thank you all so much for watching. No dinger, unfortunately, this episode. We had a great first game. I don't even remember if I got a hit in the last game. But, um... But yeah, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.